Yes, mate, you. No, 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 just no. making a video about the company. Oh, um, I'm just having a look around. So welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we're gonna to have a look at Countryside Timber Frame. It's a bit windy. We're just in the middle of this storm, Eunice. And we're here in Narborough in Leicestershire. And this place just struck me a bit interesting because of the parking, really. I mean, this is a, a public footpath, pedestrian footpath, and you're blocked by quite a few cars, to be honest. I mean, there's no way you can get past. You're forced on the road, look. So I thought, yeah, if they're gonna be behaving like that, parking like this all the way down there, what else are they up to? So let's have a little look, see what we can see. Look quite a tidy yard, to be honest. Even all the scrap wood is all strapped up. They've got signs in their skips, wood waste only. Massive forklift there, look. They've got one of them mirrors to help you see around the corner. All the vehicles are reverse parked. Oh, they've even got a sign saying reverse parking only. So they seem to be quite good when it comes on site. But when it comes to outside, they're just lacking a bit, aren't they? Well, good signage as well, look, no unauthorised access, no smoking, the sight speed limit. Even got some good security sensors and cameras up there. But I'll give you a walk past this uh, pedestrian footpath to show you what I mean. So as you get just here, you know, you're either forced to go through the puddle I want to stay on the public footpath, please. And then you're forced to go across this tiny bit of curbstone here. And then you're back on. So really it's just them two cars that piqued my interest. So let's have a further look, see what else we can find. So a bit of information from the website, it says, Countryside Timber Frame Leicester, the CTFL, are the supplier of open panel timber frame for Countryside's manufacturing division. Design and manufacture of bespoke timber frame housing solutions for the construction industry from our modern premises in Narborough, Leicestershire. And that's this place here. Reception upstairs, Unit D. Looks like they're having some uh, work done to the side of the building there. They've obviously had some work done to the building here. That would have been a solid wall. I would have thought they'd created a, an extra fire escape at the end there. But the workmanship on that, no structure going across the top, highly unusual. Yes, mate, you? No, 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 just making a video about the company. Um, I'm just having a look around. Yeah. Um, obviously, this could be a bit windy at the minute, yeah. so that uh, is obviously keep blowing over. But in an ideal world, this would be up yeah, to yeah. stop people getting too close to the uh, the project. Is it just an extra fire escape? Is it? it uh, this was an extra fire escape. Oh, yeah. 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 Be before that was done, is it a solid wall? No. No. Not a fire escape. Someone, did you know what happened there? Oh, has it been an accident? Has it? Yeah, oh, okay. Find a trailer. Right. Oh, right, okay. So it still, still haven't finished it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So come back one day. Sorry, man, I just didn't know if you... No, I'm doing a health and safety check on the place. Um, okay. The parking's not the best in the world. You've got two vehicles blocking the pedestrian footpath. I don't know whether they're staff of yours. Sorry, are you from Countryside? I can't tell you where I'm from. Do you want to see the vehicles? Just treat it like a mystery shopper. Treat me with respect and everything, and it'll all go okay. But health and safety wise, do, thanks, Dick. health and safety wise, um, when the wind dies down, just make sure your railings are back up. 
you HSE? I'm not telling you where I'm from. Just, just treat me like any other person. As pedestrians walk down here, we need at least a double buggy's width. So right. These, so these ones are fine. These vehicles. No, these ones are fine. No, these vehicles aren't ours. Okay. Well, these ones are fine anyway. Okay. Now I've noticed you have reverse parked into your compound, which is great to see. Yep. It's very good practice, and your signage is spot on, mate. Yeah. So have you got me on camera, pal? Yep. And this is all evidence. You're in a public place, so we capture no, everything. One. No problem with you uh, at all, mate. Because I just don't know why you've got me on. Because what you say is good. evidence. Yeah, I know. There's no, there's no proof that they're yours, right? But yeah, it just gives a bad image for yeah. you. I mean, this, this one's obviously yours, isn't it? Yeah, that's one. Awesome. Yeah, it is. It is. But it's so close to the next one. So, yeah, so as a double bugger can't get through there, they're then forced onto the the road. I know it's not your issue, right? No, it isn't. No, that's right. So, but whoever's issue it is, we're getting a letter. Okay. We can get the details through the DVLA, yeah, but yeah. we'll sort that. Um, okay. Apart from that, mate, you're perfectly fine, apart from the barriers, but it's wind air. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Your, your yard is perfect. Yeah. Absolutely perfect. Uh, have you been in? Nope, we don't go in. We always stay out on the public. Oh, okay. All right, so don't worry about it. You've no, done brilliant. Are you not actually from the company, are you? I can't tell you where I'm from. I don't think you're from anywhere. Do, do you know when you're out in public, yeah. you, you can remain private. Have a good day, mate. You've done brilliant. So there you go. He sort of says, oh, you're not from anywhere, are you? So he may know, but uh, yeah, a little bit of an interaction, not much. He, he was actually very, very professional indeed. So that's a big pass to that guy. So I finished off uh, looking round. He was quite proud, actually, of his, uh, his company. It was very polite, nice to see. No attitude. Yeah, he asked uh, a few few times about who am I, where am I from. But somebody who's more skilled in this area, he's just said that um, a road traffic accident led a trailer to crash into their building. The internal wall maybe wasn't damaged. The fire exit was always there, but the outer skin was damaged. And is this a safe way to leave it? So yeah, a few more bits and bobs uh, that they do inside this site. They're making open panel timber framing. They're doing a lot of the construction of the timber work off site so that when it arrives on site, it's all ready to just put together and you can see remnants there of um, that's probably a whole house there on that pallet uh, this is the future of construction I'm afraid where they make everything out of timber in places like this deliver it in bulk and then assemble it really quick so that's about it from this one countryside timber frame on a windy day on a busy road a very respectful gentleman had an incident recently with a, a lorry there that's caused damage can't keep it protected too much because of the wind a little parking issue but it's not his parking it's not his staff cars so it's a big pass from me so if you have enjoyed this one countryside timber frame give him a thumbs up and i'll see you on the next one guys bye bye for now do you know? I don't think you're from anywhere. Do you know? I don't think you're from anywhere. Do you know?